Jessica Parker is back for a new season and is managing Napoli. She's now on the hunt for success and trophies in Italy. So sit back, grab that popcorn, watch her journey unfold, because it's time for the kickoff. A game of colossal importance and a stadium packed to the rafters. We can't ask for any more. How could it be otherwise when two high-level sides go toe-to-toe -to -toe and head-to-head? -to -head? This is football out of the very top drawer. The action comes your way next on EA TV. Hello, it's great to be with you, and no problems at all on the weather front as we get ready for this match. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry, and delighted to be joined as always by Stuart Robson. And the focus is very much on Serie A, the top division here in Italy. How do you see it panning out, Stuart? Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield would be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. And this is how the hosts will begin the game today. Well, they're going to play with two wingers in this 4-3-3 formation. So they need to switch the ball quickly and get crosses into the box. But they all... Opportunity here. Huge block. going to get on the end of it well still an issue here Domenico Berardi timely intervention well news to bring you from one of the other games and big news at that here's Alex Scott Thanks, Alex. Trying his luck. Forcing him. Oh, big opportunity. And that was goalkeeping right out of the top drawer. It's absolutely remarkable. His reflexes were brilliant there. to take it short here he's lost it this might have potential well, nothing he could really do based on the cross Domenico Berardi, Martinez, what a brilliant pass, can be breathing a sigh of relief, ball one, this attack looks highly promising, oh good save, Man. Well, he missed the target and then some. 
wide it went. Samuele Ricci, Giacomo Raspadori. Oh, good run and good ball control. Can he put it away? Splendid defending. Can they hit on the break? Fed over towards the back post. Well, what a stop that was. Who can he play it to? A good looking ball. But it wasn't a taxing save. Enrique. Well, moving the ball forward, they might be in business. How about the cross? They've lost it. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Well, for power, 10 out of 10. For placement, maybe 8. It is a free kick. And it should be a Serie A game to savour. You can see it live with us here on EA TV. It's Sassuolo taking on Salernitana. What a game that will be. Two good teams in a great stadium. I'm really looking forward to that one. Oh, he'll take us on. Well, we gave it the big build-up, but he didn't quite deliver on his promise. Enrique, space on the flank, played into the box, well no problems defensively. Well they kept their shape defensively, job done for now. Now perhaps they can counter from here. a vital intervention so that will be all the first 45 minutes have come and gone a keenly contested first half what did you make of the home side Stuart? well after talking about how good their attacking play is they've just been below their best today but let's give some credit to the opposition they've had a game plan it's worked well and they've been difficult to play against as they get the ball rolling again. Interesting to see how their second half pans out. Committed challenge. He has teammates around him. A real opening now. Oh, magical piece of goalkeeping. Well, he's just pulled off a great save there. Such good reaction. It really is.
trying to deliver it accurately. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. And the ball is in the net at the San Siro. Let's hear all about it from Alex Scott. Yeah, another goal for Milan. No one was marking him. He had too much time. And it was a simple finish in the end. They're ahead by two now with 53 minutes played. Cheers, Alex. Can they forge ahead? Still a chance. Well, threat over for now. Ricci. Just the challenge that was required. Enrique. Well, they're moving it around with real purpose here, but timely defending when it mattered. an hour remaining plenty of support here good tackle take it away and he might be through here and there it is 1-0 the reverts have been rewarded and look at the celebrations Well, here's the replay, and he shows great awareness to play this through ball. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. again with the score line standing at 1-0 and the situation has changed in the Verona game let's get the details from Alex yeah it's a goal for Hellas Verona they're back level it's 1-0 with 64 minutes played Alex with the info as ever now perhaps they can counter from here well, it looks like open road for them but up a dead end cut out now what can they do with the ball <laughs> 20 minutes to go in this one is it going to end up being productive for them might be a chance here and the keeper to the rescue well he takes some beating that's for sure it really is a top class save substitution time it is here taken short and still an opportunity He's not testing the keeper at all with that cross Ustigord and beyond the last defender offside now make use of the substitute's bench. Well, they get themselves level here. And the verdict of the referee is penalty. She's pointed to the spot. Now can they square the game? Well, no card handed out, but quite a few upset players out there, Stuart. Well, he's made a genuine attempt to play the ball, so penalty yes, yellow card no. And now to level the game. And the penalty is converted. I don't think anyone really questioned him. Here is 
once again, and he makes it look so easy. He sends the keeper one way before striking it into the opposite side. That's an excellent finish. So underway again here on the back of that leveller. Still pushing for a winner. Time to play us over. I'll tell you what, that is really top class defending. And goal news to bring you from the Hellas Verona game. Alex is here with an update. Yes, it's another goal for Hellas Verona. They're now behind by one with just under 10 minutes left to play. Thanks for the update, Alex. Sassuolo unable to keep the ball. Raspadori. Can he find the net? Magnificent defending. Must take the lead here. Oh, not to be. Stopping a certain goal. Domenico Berardi. Can he find the right pass? And putting in quite the shift to win the ball back. Taking into account all the stoppages, two minutes to be added on. Lewis. Trying to get onto the front foot with the minute sticking away. Lavonka. He takes it on. Oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. And with that, the referee brings this contest to an end. All square here in what was a thoroughly compelling game. Stuart, your analysis. Well, it could have gone either way. I thought both teams were very positive, though, going hammer and tongs from the very start. And I think the draw is probably the fair result. I'd like to thank everyone who watched the coverage of this game. If you enjoyed the video, please consider leaving a like by clicking the thumbs up button. Your support really strengthens the content. Click the subscribe button and the bell icon to get notified when you manage to create more videos are released and go live. Please feel free to leave a comment with your opinions, suggestions and predictions of the next game. I just want to say thank you all for watching. Thank you. And goodbye.